Hello YouTube and welcome to Groundworks Plays Farm Manager. This is where I will be hopefully building and maintaining a beautifully orchestrated farm. Uh, and I'm gonna play with campaign. Why am I starting over you may ask? Because I haven't gotten the full release as opposed to the beta version. What the differences are, I do not know, but uh, the campaign is included. So we're gonna go through and we're gonna be starting to play the campaign mode as opposed to the free mode that I was playing beforehand. So yeah, stick around. Right, so here we are. Oh, okay, a dialogue. Finally you have arrived. Hurricane did to our family farm. I'm devastating. What shall I do now alone and with this destroyed farm? I'm too old and sick for such things. You know you how mother loved this farm. I do not want to sell it to strangers. I know you never wanted to be a farmer. However, please help me. Blah, blah. Take over the farm and help your old father. Oh, daddy. Hi. Now. Oh, yeah. I can see the, what the problem is. The farm looks as it had seen better days. Okay, let's get on right to fixing. Can we repair other things? It's not a good time. I have more important expenses. You cannot fix the cows? Hold on a second. What's more important than fixing the cows? Ah, one small warehouse. I see. Okay. So we need to fix the farm owner's house, which we did, and build one small warehouse and one poop, uh, sorry, manure storage. Got it. Now, let's first build roads, because roads are the roads to success, right? And besides, I like roading things up, makes things, places easier to get to. Now... What I want to be building is, no, not the workers, not the economy. Aha! Buildings. That's the one. Houses. House for the permanent employees. Um, I already got one. I want to do a warehouse. Ah, there you are. Perfect. Small warehouse. Okay. Rotate. Wonderful. Is this placement something I'm happy with? Hmm, hold on. I want to widen this road a little bit so that it's two because I think that will be on like on my main delivery slash undelivery road. So where was I? Ah, yes, this one. Not the houses, damn it. Too low temperature. Too low temperature for what? Cows? Hmm. Well, then notice that their caretaker has cold hands. I guess so. Oh, and you want chickens or... Uh, nope, animals in the building. Two out of six. Two cows. Okay. One time manure storage. Coming up. By the way, guys, I really look uh, like how this game is, you know, such, you know cool sedate pace so i might actually execute this in a little bit more cool sedate manner let me know what you prefer you know i think it would work well with the theme so uh manure yes shall we be placing the poop nah, hmm hmm it's close to the cows, so it's good, I guess. I mean, come on, let's face it. Nobody wants to carry that pile of shit so, so far away. There we go. I think that's still close enough. Anyways, I don't think the cows would complain. Now. Okay, delivery. Thank you. Building materials for the... Aha. Aha, too low temperature for the field of grass. I get it. Okay, we cannot spray it, we cannot harvest it, we cannot cultivate it. It's 30 days left to grow the grass. Okay, I guess. So regarding the field, we don't have to do pretty much anything. 
Oh, look at that. Building materials. This is rather a nice view. I like the overall look and presentation of the game. Although animations could be a little less blocky. At least in terms of cars and stuff. Still, I find this game oddly relaxing. There you go. Oh, is it, do you need actually scaffolding for building a manure storage? Wow, that's a first. Oh, maybe you need, maybe you do need. Okay, perfect. One small warehouse, one manure storage. Check and check. Hey, daddy. It will not at least rain on our heads. Yes, and we have poop to prove it. First of all, we need to fix the storage house or house for workers. The plants need to be planted, otherwise we will not earn anything this year and will go bankrupt. Create a new field, 10 by 10 meters, prepare land for cultivation and plant strawberries. Okay, I can do that. Once you have done the plowing cultivation, yeah, yeah, yeah. Click on the icon on a young plant to go to field creation. Will do, fine sir. Now, like we are used to, let's continue building roads. I mean, I do want this to look like a regular, you know, farmstead, so a little bit roads wouldn't go amiss. Alright. Look at that. I don't want to go for a full grid pattern, but... Okay, 10 by 10, he said. That's it. 500 bucks. Sold. Plow the field. Yes. Okay, plow, please. Who? Leanne, Coover, and Cherry Bennis. So we have two strong ladies ready to work the field. I must say, I'm impressed. What do we have in the barn? Silage and something else. Leanne Coover, let's take a view from her perspective. Except that we are looking through her head. Still, I like the perspective. I think um, we would need a little bit on the fluidity of the animations. Oh, you can hear the shovel sounds. Awesome. You know, this gives I can see right through you a whole new meaning. Look at that. This is just real pastoral beauty. Amazing. Actually, I'm just going to shut up shortly and let you enjoy and soak the ambiance. Look at that. Plying that feel like a pro. That was rather relaxing now, wasn't it? Okay, this is gonna take a little bit. That's fine. Oh, look at that. By the way, guys, you know, there is a little photo camera icon, which can make you make awesome screenshots. And uh, just a tip, you know, for those of you that might be playing, it allows you to adjust the angle upwards, which is something that the regular game does not. And I found it to be during my, you know, playthroughs, or not playthroughs, during the last two episodes that I was doing, I found it to be very handy. You can use the mouse wheel to scroll up and down. When you switch to regular mode, then it's more like orbiting camera. So kudos to the devs for including the photo mode. I really like it. 
Okay, what are you carrying in that bucket? I think it's poop. Yes, it's poop. What do we have on the market? Let's say plow the field, cultivate, fertilize. Yeah, we'll need to fertilize. For that we'll need either manure or fertilizer. And I'm hoping that I will, by the time we get there, I will be able to gather enough manure. I mean, the fields are pretty small. It shouldn't be a problem, right? Oh, this piano background is just perfect. I don't know if I'll think the same after like 10 hours or 20 hours in, but so far I love it. Oh yeah, we have to fix that house as well. Almost done with the field. Looks beautiful. Come on, a little bit more poop. Now what? Where did everybody go? Aha, I think they were tired. So, okay, so this green bar around this flowers on the guys actually means that how much energy they have remaining to do the other tasks. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, you left a spot there. No, she's just continuing. Nope, that's not my problem. That's the other lady's problem. Okay, fix it, please. There you go. And plow the field. Let's cultivate it. And who will be our next contestant? Of course, Leanne and Cherry. Or Cherry, I don't know how to pronounce that. That depends, I guess, is if this farm is in UK or in France. But given the fact that the vehicles drive on the right side, uh, and on the right side, I don't mean on the left side, that means that uh, it should be in France, so maybe it's Cherie. The offer from the labor office, hire any employees before 3rd of August to get a reward of 1,000. Yeah, and it, the, the digit says like F, I don't know if it's Frank or something. Dude, I mean, you're a little bit behind, I mean, we are in Euro now. Chloe Hudson, Aaron Day, 5 out of 5 on the strength and 3 out of 5 on the flowers are um, taken. Hire an employee, great success. Eliza Hodgson, crappy on the tractors but good with the animals. Tell you what, I don't want to go overboard because I want to keep an eye on my finances and it seems like we are bouncing back a little. So that's good. I mean, yeah, and that was the contract profit. So... Buy 79 units of strawberry seedings. I could do that. Market. Strawberry seeding. There we go. And they said 79 units. I'm gonna go for 79 straight because I'm cheap. There we go. Perfect. So now when the fields get cultivated, then it gets fertilized, hopefully. I mean, this guy with chickens is a kind of misleading, but actually I think that means care of animals in general, not just chickens per se. Okay, delivery to the barn. And that I guess is for the seeds. Yes, 79. And the top bar you can see what are the changes in terms of stuff delivered and stuff used. Cultivate field that will be soon done and then we'll go for the fertilizing field. Perfect. There you go. Fertilizing. Upwards and onwards. Manure. Out of field. Ladies, I need you to spread some love. Oh, sorry. Poop.
Cow dunk. Call it whatever you want. Oh, I love this angle. This looks so nice. Yeah, and I love the fact that they're doing it with their hands. Just an observation. If they were seeding, I would say okay, but they're throwing out cow dunk with their hands. Kudos. I hope you got gloves. It's not sprayed against fungi, insects, or weeds. So we'll just have to hope that the quality of the soil is good enough. And that there are no parasites, I guess. Oh, we got some more cow dung. Perfect. Where are you going? Are you going for the export or... Ah, uh, no, you're just taking a different route. Oh, no, you took milk. Nice. Plus 40 milk. Okay, we're almost done with fertilizing. That means we could be seeding soon. Are we done with fertilizing, by the way? Nope. Okay, perfect. Now we need to sow. Strawberry seeding. Again, autofill. Yes, thank you very much. These cows are really good at producing manure. Okay, now we are seeding. Oh, look at that. Oh, this looks so cute. Hold on, I want to see this in regular play, you know. Yeah, no, 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 not the barn. Leanne, can I look through your eyes, please? I want to see you planting stuff. Oh, look at that. Tiny patches of strawberries. Oh, I have to see that. Hello. It's a little bit wavy. I don't think people wave their heads that much when they walk. So I think the camera is a little bit, should be a little bit stabilized. Devs, if you're watching this, here's a tip. Stabilize the camera so you don't get, uh, otherwise put an epilepsy warning. A little bit of the motion like this is perfect, I think. But that, uh, like, too much swinging, I mean, they're planting seeds. They're, they're not rocking or dancing to the hip-hop music. Yeah. All right. Perfect. Okay, I can now press the acceleration a little bit. After all, we don't want to be sowing the whole episode now, do we? We have stuff to do, places to visit, seeds to plant, stuff to reap, etc. By the way, guys, do let me know if you really like this kind of first-person view. I tend to use it quite often because it gives you a, like a little bit more intimate feeling with the people that are actually doing the stuff as opposed to just managing. You get a feeling of the story that these are real people like Leon and Shari. By the way, I don't know if there is a renaming ability here, but if it's so, I might be renaming some of my guys. It would be cool if you could rename, you know, everything. People, animals, and all in all. I'll have to check if that's possible. Oh, hi, Dad. You still have to water the field. To do this, you put a well next to the field so the workers can easily get water. When you do this, all field indicators will be high. This is good because it means you don't need to neglect process if you manage to maintain the state and the field on the plants do not get sick. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, right. 
So we need to build a well. Got it. Now where would that be? Houses? Garages? Nope. 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 Oh, there you go. Well. Okay, let's place the well. There we go. And we need to water the field. That sounds like simple enough. I'm sorry ladies, a lot is required of you, but what can I tell you? Life at the farm is tough, you know? It's a hard life. But at least you're in touch with the nature. Okay, is it now water properly? Perfect. Look at that. Watering field. Done and done. Hey, Dad again. Long time no see. Price of silage has increased significantly and our cows are less and less profitable. We never produced silage on before in the farm. You'll have to build a sile silage storage. It take a while, better do it now. By the way, remember to repair the cow shed because the cow will escape through the holes in the fence. Okay, got it. Repair the cow shed, build the silage. Repair the cow shed. Oh yeah, sorry, not the barn. The cow shed. The moo storage. And where is the silage warehouse? No. Garages, production, storage for silage. In this place you can process straw, crops and hay into silage. Tons a month. Oh, well, that looks okay. Ooh, it's big. It's bigger than the manure. What do you know? Okay, uh, where shall I put it? I think here should be good enough. After all, you'll need the grass, which I'm about to reap from that side. Hmm, do I ha look happy with it? I don't know. I think I do. There we go. Okay, the cow shed seems that it will be finished soon. Ish, rather. Perfect, look at that. Door open and close now. Fix small cow shed. Oh, and let's go and uh, we have lots of cow's milk, so let's sell it. Not by 100, let's sell all. Thank you. That will hopefully net us some profit, because as far as I understood, that's the only way you make money in this game. You're selling your products, I guess. And apart from contracts. One storage for silage. Success. Perfect. Oh, dad. The landfill was built. Now you'll be able to process grass into silage. Our cows cannot wait any longer. They love it for its juiciness. Do not forget to repair the barn so that the hay doesn't get wet because it will rot. Fix barn and two units of silage. Okay, sounds simple enough. I'll start by repairing the barn, I guess. Okay, barn is fixed. I cannot still uh, mow the grass yet. Do I need to water it? Nah, I don't think so. Oh, we have Aaron here. Hey Aaron, welcome to the team. No, I'm not gonna, you know, produce two units of silage. All right, let's take a look. Grass still needs to finish. Oh, I guess we need to hire somebody here. All right, out of field. Leanne, you're on the silage duty. Sorry. Storage for silage. Aha, uh -huh, I think I need to check this one. Okay, check. What? 
Take kebab too, or... I have no idea what that is. Eight. How much do I need to take? Ten? And what is this percentage-wise? Okay, devs, if you're watching these, these sliders could use some explaining. Would be handy to know what we're getting ourselves into. Okay, I guess this is for converting other crops into silage, but we only have grass, or we don't have grass yet. We need to reap it first. Current production. Yeah, and I was worried we already have plenty of cow dunk for other stuff if we'll need to. How do you go and produce the silage? Hmm. Take above. Shall we put the bar to 100%? Put this to infinity? I don't get it. Why are we not producing any silage? Is Lien, are you, you know, slacking or what? Oh, some milk came in. Uh, tell you what, let's add silage as a resource for monitoring how much we have it. Uh, what's the over there? Aha! I need to harvest it. Autofill. Okay, you guys, let's go to harvest. Okay, this might take a while. Hmm. Oh, you're doing it old school style. I never saw grass this tall, actually. Well, I have, but... I didn't know that you guys are making grass this tall. Interesting pattern there in terms of, you know, sowing or reaping. I love the view though. Oh, and this dynamic clouds, I heard also that the dev said that they were doing this kind of, you know, ray tracing and clouds and lighting. I mean, it looks really good, I must say. Look at that. Looks just perfect. Oh, look at that, clouds. And we have rain. Well, I guess given that we need to needed to water, the fields is great. We needed the rain. And we have fixed everything, all the houses, so it's not a problem, per se. Yeah, our silage is not going up, so this is not producing. The question is why? I would love some clarification here. What is it missing? Warehouse, grass. We have 10 kilos. Do we need 100 kilos of grass? Oh, could be that. Wow, it's dark. Look at that. Whoa. House for permanent employees. I should have really had more of the employees. I guess. Oh, 1st of May. Happy Labor Day. Six degrees. Oh, and it's turning sunny now. There's some sun peeking through the clouds. Let's sell the milk. Sell everything. 647. We are making some cash. Wonderful. I guess we will be at this for a while. Cow's milk. Yeah, let's add uh, the cow's milk to the tracked resources because as soon as that gets up, I want to track it and I want to sell it. And yeah, oh, thank you, autosave. 
Still no production. Hmm. 50%? I have literally no idea what that's supposed to be. Let's set to 50. I think guys that this part was not maybe the best explained or at least lack some tooltips. But overall the game looks well. And I'm clearly understaffed. Perhaps I should hire somebody else. Uh, whom do we have with special abilities? Ifa Mitchell. Welcome to the team, Ifa. Anybody else? William Harvey. Five out of five on the animals. You see... Oh, harvesting interrupt work. I don't want to interrupt their work for sure. Okay, I guess I won't be adding more people then. Hmm. And a bit more manure. Okay, we're getting good in the manure department and we are looking bad in terms of profitability. Yeah, I guess it would help if I had a machine to actually pick up this grass because this is taking forever. Come on, reap that grass, will ya? Should I enable the other ones, perhaps? Do I need all three to produce silage? Or do I need to do some mixing of the stuff? Hmm. Guys, let me know in the comments be below if you know how the silage is supposed to be produced here. Those of you that are playing or have seen other Let's Plays, let me know, because I don't think that... I do have some grass, so I don't see why it's not working. I would expect it to start, you know, producing. So any hints would be appreciated. Maybe I should just, you know, go for the straight on boost. 34 milk. Thank you, cows. Okay, so I would say we are two thirds done on the reaping of this field. And this guy, or lady, Leanne, I think it is, who is hired on the silage, she's just going back and forth. Taking a nice stroll, eh? Oh, was that a bird? Get off! Beat it! Can I buy a scarecrow? Oh, not yet. That's a shame. I would like a scarecrow. But I could buy a tree. Make this super nice. Where do we plant it? Like this? Oh yes, a little bit of shade here and there. Look at that. We could plonk one more here. That's the stuff. Now it gets a little bit more, you know, forestry style. Okay guys, um, bet with the neighbor your foster produce five cows milk than he is. Yeah, tell you what, I'm gonna do, uh, I think I'm gonna wrap it up for this episode, we are at the 35 minute mark anyway. Uh, like if you like the video, let me know what you think of the game and the playthrough in general, 
and I will see you in the next episode, hopefully, when I do also some research as to how this silage is being produced. So, oh yeah, we've produced the cow's milk. We should probably sell it as well. Sell everything. Perfect. So yeah. Once again, guys, thank you very much for watching. Like if you like, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Until then, this is Gromforks signing off.